All right, guys, and welcome back to another episode of Eric Gets Hot. Um, I'll start off today's episode with a joke. So what did the sushi say to the bee? Wasabi! <laughs> so that's going to be uh, the thing I'm trying today. So we had Japanese food for lunch, and my wife uh, got an extra um, portion of wasabi. She got quite a bit extra, so... Um, I'll be eating that today, but I think eating wasabi straight up is just kind of nasty. Um, and although some of you may have, uh, you know, maybe wanting another repeat of the, of the gochujang episode, um, I don't really want to repeat that. So I saved a California roll, uh, and I'm just going to put a, I'm going to put a lot of wasabi on. I'm not going to, I'm not going to skimp. Before I eat it, I'll show you guys how much I'm putting on. It's way more than I typically do. Um, now wasabi is, um, also called Japanese horseradish. Um, the, the spiciness in wasabi is not oil-based. It's, it's more, a, a water-soluble chemical. So the effects of wasabi don't linger on the mouth like chili peppers do. But wasabi, wasabi is a little different in that it go, the, the vapors go up into your nose. And, um, you know, if, if you ever have wasabi when you're sick, you know, you often, have that all that congestion, all that congestion cleared up by the wasabi. So um, <laughs> that's always fun. Um, but yeah, it's made from the stem of the wasabi plant, um, and it tastes very much like horseradish. But uh, yeah, not quite, not spicy in the traditional sense, um, but definitely has some kick to it. So we're gonna eat this live on camera. As you can see, that's a lot of wasabi here, and of course, I'm gonna use chopsticks. I'm gonna do this the proper way, and. Uh, We'll see how it goes. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Horrible. Guys, I almost spit it out. Oh. <coughs> oh. 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 So most of it went straight up my nose. <coughs> oh man. And yeah, it's not spicy, but it's nasty. Oh man. So my nose is runny now and um, you might be able to see that I'm crying a little bit. Um, uh, it was very unpleasant. I could barely taste the, the California roll at all. But after the initial terror of having that in my mouth, uh, I'll, I also actually almost spit it out. I came really close to doing that on camera, but that would be uh, pretty horrible for you guys to watch, so I didn't. Uh, but uh, yeah, it, it passes pretty quickly. The spiciness is all gone by now. My nose is still running. I still have a bit of uh, <coughs> the wasabi um, flavors in my nose, the smell. And, um, yeah, eyes are definitely watering, and I guess that's why you put a, a little bit and dilute it with soy sauce, and then dip your you know, sushi into the soy sauce. And, um, I heard once from someone who traveled to Japan that in Japan you spread a thin layer of wasabi onto the, uh, you know, your sushi, and then dip that in the soy sauce, and that's how the Japanese eat it. Uh, so maybe some of you who know are, know, are more familiar with the culture, uh, can let me know in the comments. 
um, how the Japanese eat the wasabi. I'm pretty sure they don't eat it the way that I just did. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed that video uh, more than I did. Uh, and until next time, have a good one.